Hello. In this video, we'll be looking at how an organization can manage their sales funnel using open source software. Well, mostly. We'll have one piece that isn't. First, what's a sales funnel? It's the process by which a person or organization becomes an ongoing client. At the top of the funnel are people who have been exposed to your message, to your organization. Depending on the nomenclature you use, you can call these either prospects or targets. How are these people exposed to your message? Well, these days it's usually through social media such as Facebook or Twitter or YouTube or Pinterest or LinkedIn, whatever, or by your content marketing strategy of creating helpful, informative pieces for your audience and publish them, publishing them on your own platform, such as WordPress, Blogger, or Joomla, which is the platform we'll be using as an example. How you create this content and publish it to these different channels is a topic in itself. We may do a video on this later if there is su sufficient interest. Otherwise, there are a large number of resources on the internet on this topic, some more useful than others. The distinctive about prospects is that they haven't interacted with you in any meaningful way yet. What we want to look at in this video is the mechanics of getting these prospects to take the next step. The next step is for the prospects to give you some of their contact information. This is usually done in exchange for something useful. In our example, we will use the incentive of a well-written white paper. In the rest of this example, don't get hung up on the reward being a white paper. It could be a video recording of a conference, a, a BMI calculator, a long flight paper, airplane template, a set of recipe cards, anything that your prospects would find valuable and that's easily downloaded. The prospect will give us their contact information and join our mailing list in exchange for receiving this white paper. The tools we'll be using to accomplish this are a com combination of the Joomla Content Management System, CMS, and the Sweet CRM Customer Relationship Management System, CRM. You can think of the CRM system as your company's Rolodex that tracks people's names, companies, contact information. Both of these pieces of software are open source, so you can download and use them for free. We'll be touching on MailChimp, but I haven't listed it here as we'll mainly be using it in the next step of the funnel. I have two browsers open. To show what the content publisher sees, I've got Firefox open to Sweet CRM. In Sweet CRM, we have no leads, and in MailChimp, we have no members in our mailing list, no subscribers. For what the prospect sees, I have got Safari open to the publisher's website and the prospect's Gmail account. The website is just the default demo Joomla content with a couple of new items added. Imagine this to be your organization's website. In this demonstration, we're not focusing on the images or the copy. We're focusing on the mechanics and the software that makes the conversion from prospect to lead happen. Notice that in our CRM system, we may not have the prospect's name. In fact, most of the time, we don't have any personal information on who's looking at our blog post or who's seen our social media. In our content marketing, we direct the prospect to sign up for a white paper we're featuring. There is some copy at the top that describes the process and what the prospect will be receiving. The heart of this page is a form that the prospect fills out to get the ball rolling. Here we're asking for their first and last names, their company name, their work phone number, and their email address. All these fields are required. There's a tension here. We may want more information than this from the prospect, but the more information we ask, in other words, the more fields they have to fill out on this form, the fewer responses we'll get. You'll need to experiment and find out what balance works best for you and your organization. So the prospect fills out the form as follows. Uh, 
There they are. They submit it. And now what happens? They see a thank you page that tells them to expect an email. Now, we've given it a bit, and we see the prospect now has a confirmation email in their e inbox. The text says to click the link to confirm the subscription and be taken to the white paper download. The prospect clicks, and there is the download. They download the white paper, and our commitment to the prospect has been fulfilled. Now, back from the publisher's side, we go back to Sweet CRM, and we see that there is one lead with the information that was supplied by the user. We can also see in our MailChimp dashboard that we have one new subscriber to the mailing list. We'll be using this in a later step of the sales funnel. In the videos that follow, we'll look at the synergy between the Joomla CMS and Sweet CRM in the later stages of the pipeline. If you'd like a transcript of this video and notifications about future videos, please go to openfacesystems.com and sign up for our notifications. Thank you for your time.